Going to community college to pursue my dreams was really exciting. I knew that higher education would be a long journey, but too many Black, Latinx, and first-gen students like me don't have the support, time, and money to graduate if they are wasted on high school-level community college courses that don't count towards a degree. When I started college, I wasn't sure I was ready. A counselor encouraged me to enroll in a remedial high school level math course, even though I took the math I needed to graduate high school. I had no idea how much enrolling in this class would set me back. If I had initially enrolled in college level stats, I would have had a 75% chance of completing that course, but retaking high school math in college reduced the chance of completing college level stats to 31%. If I had taken both stats and a core requisite support course, my chances would have been 89%. In fact, in California, community colleges, only 3% of students transfer to a four-year college in two years. Over 375,000 Black and Latinx students attend colleges that offer a lot of remedial high school level math, even though these classes set students back. And yet, 97% of California community colleges still offer remedial classes that won't help students earn a bachelor's degree. Colleges that offer these courses waste Black, Latinx, and first-gen students' precious time, energy, and money that they can't afford to lose. This is a problem, and it could be illegal, but there is a way to fix it. If your community college is still offering high school courses, it might be in violation of the law. Your time and money are important. As for me, I eventually enrolled in transfer level statistics with a core requisite support course and I'm headed to CSU. I'm sharing my story so you know your rights and can speak up on campus. You don't have to get sidetracked like me. Go to ab705.org to see if your community college is failing you.